<laughs> if I had to summarize Emily into one word, can I, can I check the thesaurus? We met through the magic of the internets. <laughs> Our first date was at the Tap House in Sioux Falls. The irony of that date was that my aunt and my grandmother happened to randomly also show up at the Tap House. And so they had the opportunity to check out my date and see if she was uh, up to snuff, so to speak. When I walked past all the booths, these two women in particular craned their necks very quickly to look at me. I thought that was rather strange. It was a little awkward, but mostly funny. And I walked back to the booth and I sat down and I looked at Joe and I just instantly went, oh, I like this guy. I was first attracted to Emily mostly because she was very different from any of the other girls that I'd ever known. Um, she's very uh, personable, she's very goofy and silly, but she's also crazy smart and super organized and very um, driven professionally. Yeah, I mean, that's she's eclectic. If I had to describe Joe in one word, it would be vibrant. He is full of life. Um, he's um, interesting. He is colorful. The one time in my life did my mom uh, express some thoughts about a particular guy I was dating and she said, Emily, he's cardboard. He's cardboard. Uh, but Joe Quinn is not cardboard. No, not at all. He's colorful. You can see him coming. <laughs> oh, I popped the question on Christmas Day. It was lovely. We just had some nice Christmas morning times and then Joe and the kids were like, let's go for a walk in the park. I was like, okay. Taylor and Ellie and I uh, took uh, Emily to the uh, McKen to McKenna Park into the Rose Garden. I was really fascinated with the fountain and I was had my head in there and then all of a sudden I turn around and Joe's on his knee and the kids are behind and um, asked me if he's if I'd spend the rest of his of my life with him and of course I said yes and then Taylor and Ellie clapped. <laughs> Not very many engagements do you get an audience clapping and it was very, very sweet. I'm excited to fulfill, um, to help fulfill a dream that Emily's had for a long time of, of, of being married. I'm excited to see the look on her face after the I do's are over and just to see how excited that she is. Um, and I'm excited that our friends and family that are around can see this come to fruition. And uh, that's another thing that's really important to me, is that our friends and family get to be a part of it. I feel like we've been married for years based on our commitment and our love for each other from the very first date. Uh, but this is a beautiful way to join our lives together and, and really um, become whole in that promise. After the wedding, I'm looking forward to um, growing our lives together. I think it would be nice to not have to worry about that anymore, about the flying solo through life thing. And, and it's not that neither one of us are incapable of doing that. Um, I just think we're five times better when we're together. I'm excited to say this is my husband. And, and I think Joe's excited to say this is my wife. And it will be nice to have that clarification around our family that we have felt for years. Yeah, I'm excited for our life together. I love her. <laughs>